Salt Lake City School District dealing with another problem here. They do not have enough drivers to cover the bus routes. It is a problem. New specialist Lauren Steinbrecher is live in front of their bus yard to explain what the district's doing to fill the gaps. Lauren? Yeah, Dini and Mike, so when drivers show up here in the morning, bright and early for that first day of school, there will not be enough people to jump in those buses to drive those routes. So that's why the district is pulling from wherever they can within the transportation department to help out. The buses are parked, ready for the first day of school. So we're so excited to have kids back. The Salt Lake City School District just needs people to drive them. But we are seeing a shortage of bus drivers. They don't have enough bus drivers for all their routes. An email to parents on the eve of the big day let them know there may be some delays. All routes are still a go. The buses just might not be on time. We are doing everything we can to make sure we serve students, but we just wanted to, you know, be in open communication with families to let them know what our situation is. The district says the team is chipping in. Other employees with a license to drive a bus will be helping out for now. For example, the director of their transportation department. He has the right license, but that's not his job to drive. But on a moment's notice, he's able to do that. Um, other folks in the department can do that as well. They're hoping people will apply and the district can fill each bus with the driver but until then the beginning of the school year will be off to a bit of a bumpy start for buses yeah so the district is hoping that people will apply saying they're very flexible when it comes to hours and again everyone who's filling in has a license to drive a bus even if bus driver is not in their title Dini. yeah these kind of shortages are affecting a lot of districts Lauren, thank you.